And sometimes they also believe the house have operations. You know what? I feel much better. <laughs> Are you sure? Yes, I'm fine. Absolutely. Is it because of the terrible pain you suffered in the operation? No. Are you sure? Oh, yeah, I admit it. I'm terrified. This is not always good.
Concrete is completely rotten. I uh, have to take it off. Take it off, doctor. Yes. I cannot stand the pain. Don't no worry, I'm a professional doctor. But the pain, doctor. Okay, fine. Come back to the week. I won't see what we can do. Roll up and see an amazing laughing gas show. Watch as people lose their inhibitions and act like wild animals. That sounds interesting. My name is Gardner Fancy Cold, and I am here to present to you a brand new potion that leaves its users acting in the most weird and wonderful ways. Here you. Any of you. Take the laughing ass. Lavatar! I'm me! I'll ask for you. And now breathe in and just wait. I can never work 
profession again. So, Horace gave up dentistry to become a traveling salesman. Would you like to show her or the name? But he was not satisfied. Horace! William, my old friend, who are you? Making a living from selling canaries mostly. The great Horace, selling canaries. You should come to Europe with me. Anesthesia is big business. You are right, Horace. We just need the right dose for the right person. It depends on what you can practice, really. Oh, you do expertise in the South Florida folks. This new painkiller to the hospital. My arm. It was a new wonder painkiller. It was both Horace's salvation and his downfall. I must try this new medicine. Sadly, Horace saw the darker side of painkiller. Horace, you're not yourself, man. What, what do you mean? I know what I'm doing. I, I have no worries, no problem. You're addicted to that stuff. I know what I'm doing. Really? Then, one fateful day. Fred! Office, officer! Yeah. Come on! Just run up to me, blundering! Are you hurt? Oh, I need something opening! Oh, this is a blundering officer! Some kind of acid. Who is doing such a thing? Hey, you! Come here. What the result was caught and put in the notorious Tombs prison in New York. What have I done? That poor woman, I was not myself. But this medicine is both a blessing and a curse. Mr. Wells, you are free to go. Your mind is clear and you are no longer a danger to society. Go, sir, you are free. Yes! Free! I can be free! I can at least make my death painless! So let me get one last dose of blood for Horace Wells, the man who changed the face of modern medicine, who made it possible for us to have the most intricate of surgery, took his own life on the 24th of January, 1848.